Guys, the devs announced the A10A Thunderbolt 2 for Modern Warfront. Okay, so this is a different uh, version to the A10 that we have in Modern Warships because, believe it or not, all the weapons, I mean almost everything, is different. Okay, so the main difference is that in this A10 we will have air-to-air -air missile. Okay, so this is something that we don't have in Modern Warships. So, in total we will have nine missiles available for this strike fighter and you will be able to change all the equipment including the ammunition of the turrets or cannons it has a 30 millimeter gun and it has two types of ammunition okay so those can be changed before the start of the battle so I guess that we will have different types of ammunition like air more piercing and the high explosive ammunition so I guess that uh, this will be something good because remember that as I already told you the aviation here will be completely different compared to modern warships okay so we will have some kind of uh, realistic physics and the modules in the aircraft okay so we're gonna have a realistic damage also they shared a picture of the KA-50 Black Shark helicopter so this helicopter will have 10 types of weapons for all occasions and uh, there are even bombs we have a 30mm 2A42 cannon with uh, two types of shells to choose from VZT and the OFZ there are 25 uh, modules in the upgrade uh, branch. There is a Debitebsk missile defense uh, system, which automatically fights incoming uh, missiles. The downside is that uh, there are only 4 uh, pylons. Also, they shared uh, the Smerge multiple launch rocket system. Because we're gonna have a lot of uh, different uh, vehicles in this game, okay? So not only tanks, uh, but uh, wheeled uh, vehicles, anti-aircraft uh, vehicles, and uh, this type of grenade launchers. So, the characteristics of this grenade launcher is that it covers half of the game map in one volley. There are OF missiles, clustered and uh, guided uh, during flight. Missiles can be intercepted by the enemy anti-aircraft guns while still in flight. So yeah, it seems like we're gonna have a lot of anti-aircraft systems, not only anti-aircraft vehicles, but also tanks equipped with air defenses. So this is something cool because I'm pretty curious about which type of air defense are they going to use in these tanks. There will be a lot of aviation when they release the game, okay, so we're gonna have aircrafts, helicopters, everything will be in the same battle. But aviation will be available to play from tier 2 battles, okay, so if you want to play you need to, to reach tier 2. Remember that we're gonna have 4 tiers in this game. For those who don't like to play with uh, tanks and aircrafts in the same battle, there will be a separate uh, mode only with uh, tanks without helicopters or bombers. The devs haven't said anything about the closed test of the game, okay? So I thought that they were going to announce the release date of the game with the anniversary of Modern Warships, but apparently that is not going to happen because all they did was announce an eSport competition in which you're gonna be able to win money, okay? So this is something good, but I was waiting for the tanks, bro. Guys, in my last uh, video in which I made uh, my review about uh, this new Ghost Commander aircraft carrier, I told you that uh, this was trash and uh, that the stats of this uh, aircraft carrier were uh, too low. Okay, so let me tell you that I commit a horrible mistake because I forgot to upgrade this aircraft carrier because all the equipment was upgraded already so when I saw this I thought that it was upgraded and it was my mistake so let me show you once again the real stats of this aircraft carrier so they are higher but not as higher as I was expecting because look the durability is 507,000 points and if you compare that with other aircraft carriers like the Bang or Suikaku, it's still way lower. Also, okay, so the speed is good, it's higher than Suikaku and than CN Type 004. Also, the radar range 
is just like one kilometer higher compared to the other aircraft carriers. So the rest of the stats are normal and the air defense is complete, okay, so I have to say that the air defense is really good and also combined with the fact that we have four auto cannons, it makes this a unique aircraft carrier. Okay guys, so look at this, we have the magnificent Jeongjo the Great with the new missiles, okay, so we also have the K-76L cannon, which is a new reward that you can get, I mean, it is not a new cannon, but it is one of the new rewards of this event. Also, we have the laser-guided grenade launcher and the Agja torpedo combined with the torpedoes of the Defiant X helicopter, which is available once again in the gachas. So I want to test the missiles again because this time we have two missiles per slot in this uh, warship. Okay, so I'm gonna try to use the torpedoes against... No way! Who destroyed my helicopter? Okay, so I don't see anyone over there. I should get some consumables. Okay, so it seems like that submarine is right here. So I'm gonna try to attack the aircraft carrier that is hiding behind uh, that iceberg. Okay, so there are more enemies right uh, there. Look at uh, that guy. I should take some cover. I need to, to be careful. Look, there's the submarine. I'm gonna try to use the Agja torpedoes. Remember that he can't use flares right there. Okay, so this was bad, but I think everything is under control. Look at this. Okay, so excellent. We're gonna use uh, the missiles, okay, so he used the uh, flares, let me use uh, the cannon, the grenade launcher, I'm gonna use uh, some flares, uh, oh my friend, uh, you're so dead, you are, no way, look at that damage, okay, so we already destroyed uh, one enemy warship, okay, so I'm gonna try to continue here, no way, there's another warship right uh, there, I'm gonna try to use uh, the laser, look, perfect, a lot of damage, no bro, I'm so dead, also, there's a submarine that is trying to destroy me right now, and it will be even more complicated for me. Okay, so what happened there? They already destroyed my warship, but look, 1 million damage already. So yeah, it is good. The missiles are good. We have a high arc with the Heisong missile. Okay, so I'm gonna try to use the cannon. No way, it was bad. Okay, so let me use the laser-guided grenade launcher to destroy this enemy right here. I'm gonna use some flares and we did it. Perfect! We have a bomber right there, but I don't have anything to destroy that guy. So I'm gonna try to continue this way. Yeah, we have a warship right here. I'm gonna use the grenade launcher. That was perfect. I'm gonna use it again. The missiles, the cannon. Okay, that was good. Okay, my friend, you're so dead. Another elimination. We have the CN type 054B right uh, there. Let me destroy this enemy now. Let me try to aim. I use uh, some flares, the missiles, the grenade launcher, the torpedoes. Okay, so that was good. The cannon. No way, bro. Look at that damage. Okay, so we're going to destroy that guy with the missiles. No way, he used the flares, but we did it. Okay, so I'm gonna use another repair kit. There are no enemies over here. So yeah, we are good. We are good and... Uh, are no, bro. I'm so dead. <laughs> are we winning this battle? We are Team Charlie. No, we're not winning. Not yet. So the problem is that I don't have some kind of anti-aircraft uh, weapon, I only have the air defense and uh, the air defense of this warship is really weak, like we only have two air defenses and uh, that's why I equipped uh, the Typhoon Auto Cannon, because remember that with the Typhoon Auto Cannon you can also destroy air targets. So let me try to use uh, the cannon right here, what is this guy doing? I can't see anything bro, anything! Okay, so he's right uh, there, another elimination. Let's go for that CN type 054 B. I'm gonna use the torpedoes. The laser guided grenade launcher now. 
Okay, my friend. That is good. Okay, so I'm gonna use this cannon. More missiles. Okay, so we're good, we're good. We are good. We're gonna win this. No way, bro. This is bad, this is bad. I don't know what am I doing right now, bro. Okay, so we're going to destroy that guy. We did it. He destroyed our warship. But uh, we have the second place. 2,500,000 damage already. Okay, so that's a lot. Look at that bomber. Uh, that's the Mirage 4. And uh, yeah, remember that uh, that uh, bomber is equipped with uh, nuclear missiles, so that's pretty bad. Uh, look, the laser is pretty weak since we only have two lasers. I have equipped, uh, I don't remember if it was, I think it is the Helios laser and uh, the Excalibur laser, if I'm not wrong. No way, bro, there's a submarine. I need to run, I need to run. Let's get out of here right uh, now. I need to get uh, some cover, I need to use a repair kit. No, bro, I'm so dead. I'm so dead once again. I'm gonna try to destroy this guy at least. I think I can do it. Okay, bro, this was pretty bad. And uh, yeah, it was a victory for the enemy team. 3 million damage dealt. I mean, almost. It was 2 million. And uh, yeah, 6 targets destroyed. Uh, that was pretty cool. And uh, bro, 100,000 points of experience, bro. That's a lot.